Thanks for watching another quick tip video from Go Engineer. My name is Bruce Schaller, and this quick video is going to be on SolidWorks Mechanical Conceptual, a new package from Dassault Systems for doing conceptualization design. What I'm going to show you is springs and threads in this new modeling environment. There's a little intro on the Mechanical Conceptual package. Everything is done in a single modeling environment, or what's called the SME environment, where you get all your functionality in one single modeling environment. So you get sketching, features, assemblies, motion, everything really in one environment. So in order to put springs in, all we do is we go to the feature menu, we click on the spring command, and we can tell it what the type of spring is that we want and then go fill out the faces that we want to connect the spring to. We could change any of the standard parameters over here or accept them and see how the spring works. You can see in this new conceptual environment, springs behave like springs. So it's pretty simple to do. Now for threads, threads act more as a feature rather than a part we can select where we want to put the thread first or we can select it after just like in SOLIDWORKS and then we can go in and modify any of the thread parameters any of the thread type parameters up here as well we can accept that and you can see a 3D thread now this doesn't produce a large model as in traditional solid modeling software so it can be put in 3D to begin with. So you can see how threads and springs work in SolidWorks Mechanical Conceptual. Thanks for watching this quick tip video on springs and threads.